5.30, the heating the Merrimack Valley before the cold settles in. Could be two months before gas is restored to many of the homes affected by this month's explosions. WBZ's Lisa Greshi shows us teams are now going door to door in Lawrence, handing out space heaters. The National Guard arrived in Lawrence just in time to pack up the space heaters and send them out. When we got out here this morning, it was under 50 degrees, pretty chilly at 6.30. Um, but yeah, the, the weather's turning. Each space heater paired with a smoke detector. But in order to get one, the homes had to be deemed safe first. That would be up to special teams made up of fire officials, translators, electricians, utility reps, and members of the National Guard. People that deem whether A, that house is safe to take an electric heater, and the number of electric heaters that that house could take. The teams have to check out over 600 addresses. Some people eager to get a space heater. I'm sensitive to the cold. I don't like to be cold. They need one. They need one. These here, he needs three over there for the three floors. This as Governor Baker and Mayor Rivera met with businesses struggling to stay open with no gas, both promising progress. To banks and bankers and the lending community, how important this is to get this done fast. Uh, we know the bureaucracy, if left to its own vices, would think about it for months, but we don't have months. People are losing jobs, losing product, losing customers. Those passing out the space heaters today, hoping they can give out as many as possible. It's cooler, it's the fall, so hopefully we can uh, make a dent. Until then... Put another blanket on, you know, but the hot water would be nice. Reporting in Lawrence, Lisa Greshi, WBZ News.